What's going on, y'all? It's the kid J. Nolan here. Now, as y'all know, there's been a lot of speculation and rumors going on about the Migos, whether or not they're going to be able to continue as a trio. Of course, we know that uh, Quavo and Takeoff have gone off to create their own duo called Unk and Few. Offset has not really said anything. No statement has been officially released talking about how he feels about that situation. None of the Migos have been seen together as all three of them in public lately. Um, however, Offset has been trying to uh, get out of his QC deal to be his own solo artist, okay? Now, he has a deal with Motown as a solo artist. However, uh, he just released a single called 54321, which is produced by Baby Keem. Uh, the video is out and everything, but QC is trying to claim that song as part of their catalog, all right? Now, Offset just filed a lawsuit on Tuesday morning, basically stating that he's been trying to get out of this deal for some time since 2021, where he paid handsomely to get the rights to his music. In addition to the 54321 single, Offset is also trying to get a new song called Cold, which is to feature Moneybag Yo, to be released this Friday. If he can't get the business right with QC, he may actually have to delay the release of this project. There's not much that's currently known about the status of the Migos as a group on QC if their contract is coming to a close, but it has been made apparent that there was supposed to have been some sort of renegotiation for Offset. Apparently, they didn't want to meet his demands in that renegotiation, so ever since then, he's been trying to get off the label, do things on his own, secure his own deals, release his own music, and I think this may officially be the end of Migos as we know it. Now, a lot of people, like I said, have already been speculating that this was in the air since Quavo and Takeoff already been doing their own thing. But all of the members were already releasing solo projects and doing little side songs with uh, separate members. So it didn't really seem like that much of a big deal. Now, to make matters worse, Offset and P from QC have been going back and forth on Twitter with a little bit of banter, and it doesn't seem like they're in the best of situations amongst the two. Offset put this tweet up saying, this new chapter for me is personal. But then you have P from QC saying, the last lawsuit was filed publicly and dismissed quietly. Let's see how this one go. Cause y'all know the Migos tried to sue QC at one point too. They was trying to get out that deal. They, that got quiet. That got real quiet. Uh, he says, been too real for all this lame ish. Everyone know the real problem. Offset then replies, Nick's act like I'm the problem. I paid millions to get my rights back. Nigga, you blackballed me. I ain't said ish one time, homie. I ain't spoke to you in two years. Now I drop and you want your name on my credit? Mm. So clearly there's some bad blood there. He said he ain't spoke to them boys in two years. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comments, though, man. Make sure that you like and share this video. And if you're new here, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so you get all updates as soon as they go out. I'm going to turn on Culture 3 and let that thing bang. Matter of fact, I'm going to play Malibu and... uh. Hope for better days with these guys. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to catch you guys on the next one. All right? Much love and respect. Peace.